Any final words about joining Basic in AIT, like just to wrap it up? No, just good luck. <laughs> <laughs>、guys. Sorry, Masiba here and Flor. And today we are going to be talking about what not to do in the army before you join. If you don't know it by now, you probably see my videos. I really prepared to join the army to be in basic training, but now I will give the floor to my wife about her experiences before she joined and being in basic and whatnot. So here we go. So this is like what not to do. When and why did you join the army? When and why? Okay, when it was in 2011. Obviously, it was the year before 2010 when I did all the talking to the recruiter and got my paperwork to ship out and all that. But I didn't leave till March. Was it March?、Mm-hmm, March? March 2011. Okay. And yeah. Why did you join the army? Oh, why? why? My bad. I forgot about that. Sorry. Why I joined because I didn't want to go to school and I was financially strained, so I was like, I don't think I can go to college. And I heard through some friends that if you join the army, they can give you free college, and so that that was my main motivation. Okay, so what did you do before you joined the army when you're ready to go? What did I do? <laughs> I didn't do anything. I just basically what happened was I got a number for a recruiter, thanks to my cousin, and I contacted him. And he basically, you know, you do all the paperwork, find out stuff. Like、um, he came over and he was like, "You gotta take this practice ASVAB," and I had to like. I I felt I remember I felt and he said I needed to study harder and, or like study and basically、um, I asked about the benefits and yeah he confirmed that yeah you do get like the GI Bill so I was like okay I'm down and so he made like the I guess we went to Mets like he did that okay I just showed up I went I did my ASVAB there and I actually did okay. I got a seventy something, and they offered me three MOSs, and basically, obviously, I didn't do any research whatsoever. I just basically、um, saw the videos that they showed me for each MOS, and based on those videos, I picked my MOS. There was one called Military Intelligence, and sixty eight Whiskey Medic, and. I am not good with computers, so I just was like, okay, I'm gonna go with the medic thing, and so <laughs> I got, I finished my paperwork there, and、um, they were like, okay, you're good to go, and they just told me I ship out in March, but、mm-hmm. I think I signed up around October or September or something like、okay. that. Was the recruiter really、uh, honest with you? What did he say that you were actually expecting but didn't happen? Well, he basically said, like, it was gonna be a regular job, like nine to five, <laughs> and he made it seem like okay, it's just a regular thing, you know. It, it, but it's also my fault because there's like resources, like, to find out about what to expect when to join. But I didn't do any of that whatsoever. I was just like, I didn't know you had to do a PT test. That was a shock to me when I got to basic. I didn't know. He did tell us like, oh, you gotta do push, up, you know, the PT test. But he made it sound. I mean, it is easy once you. But I didn't train whatsoever. Like,、okay. didn't your、uh, drill sergeant or someone in AIT said like, you joined the army while you guys are complaining? So there was a time in AIT. Obviously, I didn't research.、So、I don't know. But he was saying like we were all complaining about running. Like, oh, like we don't want to run. And he, the platoon sergeant, was like, "Why are you guys complaining?、Uh, you're gonna have to do PT every single day while you're in the army." And that's when it hit me. I was like, "Wait, we have to do PT like every day." Every day. I was like, I thought this was just a training thing, like from、mm-hmm. basic and AIT. I didn't know it was like a a thing. So that was that was a shock to me. What was a、uh... I guess like an unforgettable thing that happened in basic training or like really cool experience. 
Uh, well, I didn't, tr I didn't know what, I never thought about asking my recruiter what basic, what we were going to do in basic. Um, so when I was there, it was just a shock. Everything that happened there was like, what's going on? Like, the only reason why I think I passed my basic training or I was able to do it was because I was terrified of failing. Um, but every new thing that we did, I was shocked that we had to do anything. I was like, wait, we have to carry this rifle around? Like, why? So like, you didn't know you were going to carry a weapon all the time in basic? No, I didn't know. And then, <laughs> like, when they gave us the two giant duffel bags to carry around, I was like, I cannot carry this. This is too heavy. I was able to do it, but I just... I was really shocked at all the things, like all the gear we got. I was like, why am I getting like this fucking, um, what was it called? The IOTV. The IOTV. Why am I getting this? And then like, you don't wear it like the first two weeks or like after uh, a certain week. I don't know which week. I forgot already. You start wearing it every single day, like all the time. And it's just like, oh my God, this is so heavy. Okay, I got a question for you. What was in your mind when you guys were getting smoked because of other people being stupid? I didn't think anything. I just went with the flow. You just did it? I just did it. Okay. How about showering in the same giant shower room with like 20 plus people? That was really awkward. I hated it. Like I remember the first night we got there and I was like, holy crap, I have to take it. It was a bay and the, there was no like separation, like no curtains, no nothing. like. It was just a big giant like shower room with lots of shower heads. And I was just like, ooh, like I am so embarrassed. And but after a while once you you're in a hurry and you have to like like especially like after breakfast and like or PT and breakfast and you have to like hurry up and shower for the mm -hmm. the rest of the day. Like you know, it's you get used to it and you just don't give a shit, like, oh, since you talk about food, how was the food? Did you like the food? Yeah, I liked the food. It was good. <laughs> I mean, you get food, you don't have to freaking wash dishes, and it's okay food, honestly. I don't I I thought it was fine. Okay. I don't I'm not a complainer. Um, how about the drill sergeants and the instructors in IT? You think they were strict or you think they were helpful or they're just not even doing their job? I think they were awesome. <laughs> I think they were really nice. I don't I don't think they were evil. I don't think they I think they probably only flipped our like bay area like twice if anything i i don't remember them going like in ait that was a different story those instructors have issues mm. they would destroy our bay all the time so but in basic it was just like they only i honestly i think they only did it once and then they i guess they never did it again were you homesick or were you scared when you shipped <gasps> yes the night at the hotel uh, prior to going to the Mets area again, it was like, oh shit, what have I done? Like, is this really what I... Okay, especially because you got to consider, like, I had no research. <laughs> I was a bad person. Like, I didn't... I didn't... How do you call it? Inform myself or... Mm -hmm. I, so I was really going in blind. Like, I had no idea what to expect. So that night at the hotel, I, there was another girl in there. She was also shipping out. And, like, I started to cry, and she just, like, hugged me, and we were, like, she was, like, it's okay, and I was, like, hey, why did I do this, and I was just crying, but finally, I just had to go to bed, and woke up the next morning, I had to, basically, I was in fear the whole entire time, the fear. 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 Okay, how about, like, CQ or a fire guard, what do you think about those things? Fire guard, I thought it was fine, it's only, like, what, two hours? Mm -hmm. So, um, I thought it was okay. I didn't think it was bad. I mean, it is bad because you're like always like, how do you call it? Doing something. So, and you will have lack of sleep and So this kind of pertains to free time also. Like, do you have free time in basic? <laughs> no. No way, Jose. No. Not gonna happen. No, I, d I don't remember any free time. If anything, it was like the weekend on Sunday. And even then we had to like do freaking yard work and like clean the bathrooms but that's something you know like that's where we hung out so it's like i'm fine with cleaning the freaking toilets and mopping and all that 
But yeah, people would get caught like <laughs> just trying to sleep in the bay oh, while they're supposed okay. to be cleaning. Okay, you don't really have to answer this or probably just like not give the whole detail, just like the highlights. Were there people that mess around in basic or got in trouble? You know? Was there people that messed around in basic? Um, I don't. I ain't even gonna. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything because you didn't see anything. Right? I feel like if they watch this video, they'll know I'm talking about them, and they'll be like, "What the fuck, bitch!" And but I'll you know, like, but you didn't see anything, right? I, I, I didn't see anything. Okay, yeah, that's that's a good answer. Yeah, I, didn't see <laughs> I, didn't, I don't know. No say. How about um, since you weren't really prepared for basic, um, how was the physical training in basic in AIT? Were you able to lose weight or show, tell us a story about like? physical improvements okay so i went in the army i weighed 125 i think and i'm five feet um i was so out of shape i couldn't do sit-ups i couldn't run i couldn't do push-ups but once we initially got there we had to do a pt test they're like hey you kind of need to like you need to go do this i think they call it d group and like we have to improve like because those people were really out of shape like me mm -hmm. but Honestly, like the training is really hardcore. <laughs> it really is. I guess if you're in shape, it shouldn't be a problem. But if you're going in out of shape like I did, it will be like, holy crap. Like I couldn't even run a mile. And then by the end, like I was able to pass my PD test and do my sit-ups, push-ups and run. And I, I, when I got out of there, I weighed 113. So I lost weight. Mm. But then I went to AIT, and we had a little bit more freedom, but still same like amount of work, like training. And I think I went up to 115 when I got to Germany. Okay, so I guess for the new viewers or uh, people that are trying to join, what advice can you give them? Do your research, like <laughs> ask a lot of questions like to your recruiter and like use the internet you know like drip 46 and archie here they like to make those videos so they like to inform people and like i guess what i'm trying to say is it'll be okay like you will get through basic it's nit too like i was in fear the whole entire time but i was able to do it like fear is what kept me going fear of failing fear of like oh shit like i'm gonna get recycled or like stuff like that so You'll be fine if you actually um, prepare. Prepare and like, don't go in like I did. Like, I didn't know anything. I didn't know what to expect. But obviously, if you're watching these type of channels, and that means, you know, you're already in the right path. Yeah, right. in the right path, unlike other people. Okay, I got a good question. Um, were you treated differently, or did people say something because you're a female, especially in basic? You know, like uh, people that are privates as well, or whoever being a female in the military um i guess with me i guess it i don't want to talk about it honestly <laughs> um you know i already told you my basic and how i was treated it was fine like some people can i i don't want to say it you don't have to say names no because uh, um oh, you, can you know they they said i was like there was favoritism towards me and stuff like that, mm -hmm. but... You didn't see it. <laughs> no, I obviously I did see it, but, <laughs> <laughs> but I did try, like, I really did do my best, and okay. I mean, I guess, I don't, I don't want to, I don't feel comfortable talking about that. Uh, one final thing, um, I guess you gave the tips already. Um, any final words about joining BASIC in AIT, like, just to wrap it up? No, just good luck. <laughs> <laughs>